themselves, actually. Interesting. Yeah. They had. I didn't see Liquid's last band and Secret Band, the Viper. I guess they just didn't. Again, more confused about the gyrocopter. <laughs> I, I guess it's their option against this. Well, we're gonna wide. find uh, an early first blood. Apparently, Team Secret go for the five-man smoke wrap around the Roshan pit into the offlane area. They are gonna be able to find Kuro. Chen is going to be our first blood at the top of the scoreboard, but just as easily could have gotten them from skeletons and the like. And he'll be making his first rotation now that he's about level two. Heads over to the jungle. GH is currently uh, contesting Puppy a here, but a mind control here as well. They might be able to get some really good body blocks and bring him down. The centaur closes the distance, is able to get the stun. But Tumba Man helps him out, and again, it seems nighttime though. Almost about to come up, and that first rotation is really where I'm going to be watching Puppy. What he can do. Is there just time for it? It's just farming. Is GH gonna get gone on instead? Plays so down the kick. Out. He has no roll away. So Ace will eventually slice and dice him down. And Kuro not likely to catch him. The ensnare is just not gonna be there. That troll. Yeah. First major rotation so far from this Chen and a much more passive laning phase than we saw last game. GH doesn't have a whole lot of mana to work with. Kuro goes ahead and covers his brother, and they should both be fine. But Secret, I mean, ultimately, it's the loss of Secret, right? They're just not getting anything done with Nine Stalker. That sounds good to me. Secret is going to be gone on here in the mid lane. Nice kick back there with a stun. They're going to be able to get some front face damage here on the mid one. Bringing him quite low, but now he's going to start getting the quills out. That's why GH has to abandon going for that kill and leave Miracle to it. Do you manage to pick up that one? Puppy needing to fly out of the sprout, though. He's not going to be caught by that one, but maybe Absor will. Already slowing him down. They do have another Seder nuke coming in, and the last... Oh, no! An uphill miss! They're not going to be able to get Yapsor, it looks like. Puppy's going to get blocked out a little bit. Already used his flight, so he's going to get ensnared up, slowed down underneath the Tier 1 tower here. A Seder Blast is going to miss, but a roll-in will not. GH nails that kill, and Ace looks for the rebuttal. Will manage to pick up a fast crit there on a GH, but still, it forced a rotation. Liquid won't be too sad about that, I'm sure. Straight up executed. Really unfortunate, though. For Liquid as the uphill miss saves the App Store's life. Would have been well worth it for them. And probably still is. Kill on mid one. Yeah, and it's That'll... not an easy hero to burst down Radiant's with the heroes that Liquid 2 has. Secret. Get in it again. See mid one gone on here. Another kickback. Mid one's going to turn himself away, but it does mean he's running himself away from his allies. He will end up dying here. GH going to get caught. Needs a little bit more though, and he can't actually go for it. The Winter Wyvern has to back away from Miracles. Dragon Knight looks to be able to catch the opposing dragon. Won't be able to do so as he flies over the trees. Something that Dragon Knight cannot. Everyone's starting to get a little bit low here. Yeah. It's because of this bottom area. Yeah. Eight minute rune spawns and it's a haste. Picked up the Dragon Knight. Trading away tier one towers looks like at the top lane. Bristleback is going to do just what you suggested. Stand in front of these tower pushes. Mid one's doing that, but Pain's definitely died a lot to Liquid early on. Whoa, Fada dropping low. Miracle's going to go for the kill, but they do manage to have a magic wand save. Fada maybe going to die to neutrals instead. Also feeling a little bit of burn damage and will end up dying. The Dragon Knight's poison is just. <laughs> It'd be a really nice one. Mind controls, hidden away in the trees. Fada actually goes for the skewer, breaks down a lot of those trees, does reveal him now. There goes the dagger, catching up. They just need a crit out from Ace, and he's not going to be able to get in four hits, but still, he gets a fifth hit that does manage to claim the kill. Now in mid lane, the long Liquid rotation. are going for a long dive in, hoping to be able to catch the Winter Wyvern instead. Going to have to turn around and go for the Bristleback. Bristleback's going to take so much magic damage straight to the face off of that cold embrace. If only he could have faced it, just challenges them. Yeah. I forgot that they had mind control, so he's going to be the one for the Silver Edge. Oh, that's true. Mid one, stuck inside the trees, does have a missile heading his way. Miracle with the double damage coming from behind. Here. They're going to be able to get the silence from Puppy, so that'll help things quite a bit, mitigating a lot of the damage, but Bristleback's just being kited around by a Gyrocopter, and it's already down to half HP, so he can't turn and fight Miracle with the Well, do you think that was part of the reasons that uh, Bristleback did kind of disappear for a little while? Stun does manage to snag the Magnus. Even after the skewer has gone out, they'll bring him down underneath his tier one tower. But Secret are looking to contest, or at least not let Liquid take this tier one tower. Mid one looks to stand in front of it. But it's still a Dragonite. He's going to be able to get a lot of chip damage. You're not able to put a real damage threat on the board here. And none of Secret, at least not these two anyway. Yapsor and Mid one, they don't represent a whole lot of damage. Yeah, they're just going to watch this happen. Some time wasted, although it does require. Liquid to commit a lot of their course for this as Atama Man gonna fire off his ulti. 
in that vicinity. If they can't, and Miracle not the target the that they ground. want to run into here as Secret making their way forward. Ace is front. Oh, they're going to try and force this anyway. Trying to go into Miracle. This is going to be tough. A little bit of chip damage onto him. Ace is just baiting him around with the <laughs> daggers over and over again. I Maybe forced into a fight here, Miracle. Chasing him down. Oh, just stole. Nobody's going to stop the missile, so they're going to be able to get a lot of damage here. Follow-up's done for Miracle. It's going to be there as well. So they're going to control mid one for a lot of time, but they do have the Cold Embrace from the Winter Wyvern. He's still got his ultimate as well, so Liquid are making sure not to group up too much. Ace is going to go for the kill on him. Tumba Man take a lot of magic damage. Will manage to bring him down with the health beam power, and Miracle's just getting kited around constantly. Doesn't have any help from uh, his allies. They've completely abandoned him. Mind Control really couldn't do much as a Furion, but he actually gets a little bit too close. Going to be silenced up. Beautiful block with the Sprout there. That's going to make double trees to be able to get through, but they still manage to catch him. Second teleport is not going to be enough to make it out of here, and Mind Control does go down. They get all three cores out of that. Wait, and like you said, I don't think they had to even commit the RP for that. Nope. Mana still has enough. They are going to lay down the call now, but this Gyrocopter continues to get behind. This is the benefit of having this Magnus. This GH going to get run out too. He does have a decent amount of farm. All things spot. Uh, he's going for the extra kill. Matumba Man brings him up the cliff. And Secret will feast on a gyrocopter kill in every fight. And that's that. So we go back to Matumba Man as the damage dealer for Liquid Team. It's not easy though. It's no. the top. Look at this. They're four man around him. They managed to get. I guess bottom lane was really well pushed in. All of Liquid spells. Yeah, Furion split pushing. Like, he, you still have to win team like it's right. Oh, yes. Nothing feels better than Secret do back up. Liquid's lineup right now lacks a lot of everything. They've got some creeps, and they're nice, but where's the damage going to come from? It can't only come from Miracle. And now the high ground assault begins. Mid one. And Even Ace. Even Miracle's looking like pretty squishy. The goo being thrown on him. Ace is going to be gone on here. They're trying to time this. Time the Ace is going down, but Fada is actually going to get jumped on. One second down, and Ace is now exposed. But a great winner's curse going on the Jar Cup. Did they bring down that big damage dealer? And Ace is able to get himself far enough away from the Dragonite. Dragonite turns and goes for Yaptor instead, hoping to be able to finish off at least support kills here. And will manage to get one of them, but is getting kited around so heavily by Secret that he doesn't feel comfortable pursuing. So Secret are going to be able to get away with four members here, unless the TP cut off. They do have Mirror. Miracle teeping in, they do manage to get the stun from GH. Follow up here from Mind Control, controlling up the Bristleback, but that's actually blocking out Miracles. He's got to jump under the trees with the Blink Decker. Four step forward, that was actually put on a Miracle instead of the Bristleback by Fada on accident. So he has to secure himself again anyways. So uses that time to roll on to the Phantom Assassin who is at half health and Miracle now has to run away. Armor is broken, Ace looking for it as the top at the same time. Puppy might just go down. He's got the phase boots, but you can't outrun the homing missile. And 400 gold for a support. Puppy tries to spot some of these heroes. Maybe he can get they start curse. getting onto the high ground and they manage to run into Kuro, who's trapped by his own creeps. Get it out of there, but Ace oh, is down. able to get the kill first. They manage to get the centaur stun, follow that up with another one, and Ace is going to be stalled up for quite some time. GH gets the roll in, but it's not going to result in a whole lot. Just a minor amount of damage over time that Secret will shrug off as they go for the Roshan kill. They go for the Miracle kill. He's going to blink himself away into the mid lane. No blink up for seven seconds. Mid one can catch him here. Fada thinking about going for the RP. Is he actually going to use it here? He's hoping to be able to hold off, and I don't think he needs it whatsoever. Four members surrounding Miracle. He's going to get brought down. All the armor in the world will not keep him alive. Ace just chilling out solo against Roshan. But I don't know how much this split gives them. They can just empower either the Bristleback or the PA, send them up. There's going to be a cheese now on this Bristleback. It makes it even harder for them to contend with. Man slowed down. Has no BKB to use with the TP, so he can't get out. And Chen's gonna die in the mid lane. Until my man goes down at the same time. And without <laughs> half their <laughs> team here, they're so far ahead, they're like, yeah, just two man into the, the base. Why not? Who cares? Yeah. With three heroes dead on the side of Liquid, I think if even if they even had like Four heroes on the side of Liquid Secret would still do this. Yeah. Because mid one's gigantic. He's level 20, so he's now got that spell lifesteal happening alongside the Radiance. Plus the cheese. Ace has obviously got his extra life in the ages. Yeah, 
and Secret trying to wrap this game up. Immediately going to bottom. Nobody's near them still on their team. <laughs> Team's starting to move towards them, but the roll-in's going to happen. So this is going to be the first line for both of them. Maybe they can actually kill the Bristleback before he gets off the cheese. The Cold Embrace goes off, and he'll have the chance to be able to pop this cheese. It looks like the stun goes down a little bit more, but mid one gets it off. Full heal up, and Ace, he brings Miracle dangerously low. It's going to pursue him to get a 1,255 damage crit, and he'll get another one on Kuro. I'm sure if he can just close that distance, the Sprout is going to be able to protect him for a second, but there it is, the second crit from Ace. Finishes off another hero. Be gone, godlike for him, as Secret just steamroll through Liquid into their base. Going to be able to catch GH as well. Skewer him on back to the rest of the team. And a completely whiffed ultimate from Matumba Man. They started throwing buybacks around, but it just doesn't seem to matter. They just get the halberd off onto Ace as he blinks in on the Matumba Man, but the magic damage is just pitiful at this point in time. Secret just keeps on running it here as they're going to be able to find another one. Fought it, getting the RP off. Couldn't get the skewer back though as he gets sprouted and separated from Matumba Man. Finally, they back off, but Liquid, they know they are completely out of this game. Secret successfully push it to a game three. They're out of that game for a while. When they couldn't get that first fight um, successfully, I think this game became.